All right, I'll be honest with you guys. This is something that I was super worried about when I first got this Fahaka, Fahaka Puffer fish. I can't even talk. Yeah, so I basically threw him in a tank. I was there playing some uh, games, Pokemon. I just do it for fun at night. Um, it happened for my other YouTube channel. And all of a sudden, I saw this. Yes, as you can see, my Fahaka Puffer is going after my Tetras. Right now, an update on it, they're pretty much gone. There's only two of them left. I bought 11 of them at Petco just because people were telling me that it's a good fish to put in a tank. But unfortunately, he was hunting them at night. And the reason is because it was my fault. I, for, I didn't know what he, he, what he wanted to eat. He was hungry. It makes sense. Fish, when fish get hungry, they're going to search and find small fish. Now I know he eats shrimp. Um, the guy like a bag of shrimp from the grocery store. He eats that every day or every other day. Um, so basically what he does is we throw a shrimp in there and eats it. Every time I do that, he does not mess up any of those fish. So at the end of the day, I did thought it was him because he just didn't want him in there. But at the end of the day, like I said, it was just because he was hungry. So that's my fault. I need to educate myself and learn more because I never had one of these fish before. So, yeah, it's okay. I do have that shrimp, uh, bag of shrimp, and yeah, we are, that's what we feed him, and I'll do a feeding, feeding video with him, um, the other, meh, and maybe the next video we'll do a feeding with him, feeding video with him. Today, for some reason, I cannot talk. Um, I am in the process of ordering some more fish from Predatory Fins, just because we only have two fish in there, and I don't know, it might be an Oscar, it might be a, I was gonna get an Arowana, but I was, unfortunately, I was worried about the Fahaka Puffer messing with him, but now I know he doesn't really mess with fish. We can definitely add that Arowana in there, but I don't know. Arowana's get super big, and I think my best chance is just to add an Oscar just because uh, he, the Oscars are perfect. They, one of them goes in the 75-gallon tank. We have a 125-gallon fish tank, so at the end of the day, like I said, I think the Oscar is the best bet, maybe add like a Pleco or something like that. I'm going to get a giant Oscar just because in case the a Fahaka Puffer comes after him, it's not going to be that big of a deal because the, the Oscar can take care of himself. Alrighty, guys. So that is about it. I hope everybody enjoyed this uh, episode. Like I said, we're going to be um, updating once a week. Yes. Once a week, every Sunday. And yeah, we're going to have a good time while we do it. And we'll see what this journey does and wherever it takes us. Alrighty, guys. Thank you again for watching. I hope... Oh, okay. That messed that up. Alrighty, guys. Thank you again for watching. I hope all of you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see all of you guys on next time episode. Peace.